<laughs> All right guys, what is up again? Welcome back to another video of Depths of History. Guys, today, well, I don't even know how I can say it. I've got a job to do today, guys. I actually have to go out today to a lake. I'm actually meeting up with my buddy Jeremy who actually lost his phone in the lake while he was fishing for bass. And the funny story about it is, he literally had three things gone missing at once. He lost his fishing pole, his glasses, and his phone. He found the glasses and the fishing pole but he lost the phone. So we're gonna go over there and see if we can scuba dive and hopefully we'll find this phone. I have really high hopes. The visibility there he told me is not really the best. So we'll see how the camera looks underwater, but I'm right here at Diver Supply Marietta. I'm gonna pick myself up some tanks and I'm gonna go over the gear that I'm gonna be using. But guys, I am so excited to get in the water and hopefully find his phone because, because honestly guys, his whole entire business is on this phone. He has over 600 contacts. Basically his whole entire business Business is based around a cell phone so I know the phone's gonna be shot it's a Samsung Galaxy S7 so there's probably gonna be some water that's gotten into it after it's been down there for probably two or three days now I think something like that but but what I'm really hoping to find is the phone because inside of it he can get that SD card out and he can also get all of his contacts back and hopefully get everything back in order for his business here we go one there we go, man, I got three really quick, that's crazy. So guys, I've got a lot of gear back here. You can see I've got not one, not two, but three scuba tanks, just in case we're gonna have to stay out here for a while. I've also got my Hog VCD. It's got a custom back plate harness, and the great thing about these things, guys, is they actually make them custom fitted. So this one's actually custom fitted, so it'll fit me perfectly. I've also got my flippers, flip, flop, this is my Fisher M-Scope, and I'm gonna be using this today in the water to hopefully find this phone, but it's an overall great metal detector, and I'm really looking forward to using it in the water today. Now guys, each of these tanks are gonna allow me to stay underwater for about an hour and a half. I don't think we're gonna need that much time. Um, hopefully, there is the chance, you know, I mean, it is a big lake. I think he knows the area where it is, but I, I'm not 100% positive. I do have three tanks in there, so that gives me about, if I need it, probably about four and a half hours if I will need it. But honestly, it's five feet deep, so I'm probably not gonna be using my air as quickly. And we're gonna hopefully see that we can find this phone. I really hope that we can return it to him because it'll get his business back and running. And I know he has a lot of stress from losing that phone. Anytime you lose anything that's super important like that, guys, it just, you have that gut-wrenching feeling that you're not gonna get it back and it just ruins the whole day. So hopefully we can make his day a million times better, but let's jump into the water and get on the boat and go to the lake. All right, so we are on the way now to the place. Oh gosh, I gotta get some gas, hold on. All right guys, so we gotta get some gas in the car, but first, I need to show you guys a trick. If you ever, if you guys ever want to get cheaper gas at a gas station, all you gotta do is get this app called Get Upside. And I've been using my receipts. I've been like scanning my receipts and basically what it does is it gives me cash back for every gallon of gas that I get. I'm gonna ask for a receipt right here. Gotta pay for it first. All right. All right, right. All right, time to go. Hopefully we find this phone. I'm really hopeful for it. For those of you guys who don't already know, I just adopted a monkey and currently my girlfriend actually just got this for me. So pretty nice of her. Thank you so much, Grace. Boop. We are actually changing up the scenery a little bit. I'm actually at a lake. I'm actually in Northern Georgia today and I'm with my buddy, Jeremy, who actually had an accident about what, what was this like a couple days ago? Two days ago. Two days ago. And he actually lost his phone in the lake, dropped it, and went looking for it. He couldn't find it. He found his Oakleys and he found his fishing pole, but he wasn't able to find the phone. So we are going to be trying to jump in the water today, see what we can find, and hopefully we can find that phone. I'm pretty sure we'll be able to. Let's get the scuba equipment on, get in the water, and hopefully we'll be able to find this phone.
said ride around in here, right? That way? Yeah, no, no, this way. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah! There we go! <laughs> there you go. Oh my god. There we go. Oh my god. Awesome. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. You are the freaking man, dude. Heck yeah. Man, that is so awesome. Keep yeah. that 100% recovery oh rate right there. Right. Right. <laughs> that just saved me so much money. And just actually, you just saved a small business with that right there. Yes, sir. There we go. That is what's up, dude. <laughs> Alright guys, so as you saw from my GoPro and my reaction, we ended up finding the phone. Uh, this is Jeremy's phone and actually Jeremy's business is on this phone. So basically his whole entire business is basically centered around this phone. So he's going to be able to get the SD card out of this because it's waterproof and get all of his contacts and things for his business off of it and save everything that he has. But I'm just so glad guys that we were able to find this in the lake. You know, it didn't, I mean, it took us quite a while, honestly, to find it. But the fact that I was able to find it and bring it to the surface and return it back to Jeremy is awesome. He's actually behind the camera, so I'm going to give this to him. You are the man. But, <laughs> man, so much. it's just, it's awesome to be able to find things and give them back to people. That's what I love about this hobby. And I'm glad we were able to make his day and, you know, not have to go home empty-handed. So, really excited, man. Unbelievable. Yeah. Thank you so much. Of course. Of course. I don't know if y'all saw my original reaction, but uh, <laughs> I'm flipping out, dude. I can't believe you found it. That I mean, is awesome. I'm I'm sending I'm taking a picture of it right now. So this is the man, the myth, the legend behind the camera here. That's this awesome. guy's awesome, dude. <laughs> oh my gosh! The whole last year of my life, I've ran my own company. Uh, all my contact over 600 contacts in here that I've made in the last year, building up my company. I have an HVAC company, and uh, man, it's just. I can't even explain. I, I'm, I'm so right now, I'm almost in tears. It's overwhelming. That's awesome, man. Because it's like, oh my gosh, my company, like literally finding this phone just saved my company. I lost a lot of money over the last two days and yes. could have been way worse. So yes, definitely. Heck yeah, man. You're the man, dude. You're the man. <laughs> it was just amazing. I mean, you know, I, I've had several, you know, ring returns and stuff like engagement rings and things like that. Finding a phone was a little bit different today, but it definitely, I mean, it gave off a killer signal. Like when I went over it, it was a really, really solid hit, which was what I was hoping for. What's bad is I was off on my location of hair, so it was like, <laughs> we were like. Had all these bottles lined up. This actually really helped a lot because I started gritting out like this section of the area over here, started making my way over to the left. But when I was over here, over on this area, we were also able to find a lot of trash in here as well. Clean up the waters, always good for sure. He freaking found it. He come up, I was like, man. When he came up, it was like, uh, I've been waiting on him to come up through the air, like with his hand up first. And it was so crazy because that's exactly how he came up. Hand first with the phone and I'm like, ah! like freaked out, dude. So, yeah, so I've got it in the Ziploc. I'm going to take it down to the specialist. I was off like 30 or 40 feet, probably. I told him there's 600 contacts in here that are going to subscribe to him or else. <laughs> that's awesome, man. <laughs> so, I'm gonna put you on speakerphone. <laughs> did he or did he not save a small business today? Yes, he did. Thank you so much. Of course, of course. I'm glad I could help you guys. You're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, can't beat it. I didn't even think you could go through this. Well, uh, I didn't either. The first time I did. <laughs> this is only the second time, so. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at this. Yeah, it's kind of creepy, isn't it? Oh my god. <laughs> Holy cow. He's the one that gets all the... Gets all the rats and the... Yeah. And the, and the nasties. The, those things will kill poisonous snakes too. Really? Yeah. I never uh, even knew that. Well, let me just say, I've heard they'll kill poisonous snakes. I'm not, yeah. Don't quote me on that. 
Just came out of right there. That's crazy. Little little passageway to get to the other side. All right, guys, we just got back. So let's see how my backup game is today. All right guys, so that is going to wrap up today's video. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this today. I mean, it was kind of a different video for me. Normally I'm in the rivers looking for historical objects and relics, but I'm really glad we were able to get Jeremy's phone back. And as you saw, his reaction was literally priceless. So I wanna thank you guys all for watching. If you can, please hit that like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We're almost to 40,000 subscribers. And for 50,000 subscribers, we're gonna be having a pretty big giveaway, but I'm not gonna say anything yet guys I'm gonna let you guys go hope you guys have a great rest of your day thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time